COVID-19 has obviously been difficult for everybody internationally and we've in the NHS tried to focus on making sure that we can still deliver the care that our patients with cancer require. So primarily a lot of the uh, changes that have occurred within the centre I work in has been to cancel uh, or postpone non-cancer care. So reducing and um, stopping any elective surgery, elective procedures so that we can still give the uh, cancer treatment which has been uh, proven of, of benefit. For the patients with diffuse large B-cell lymphoma, we have had to close um, or suspend uh, many of our clinical trials. However, we have continued with the phase one, phase two trials where there are no other treatment options for our patients. So we have tried to address um, reducing visits for patients where it's going to be of minimal benefit for them. Obviously, our patients are shielded because they have a diagnosis of cancer and have had treatment. So we do not want to bring them up to the hospital for any unnecessary visits. Uh, and, but we also are keeping um, our treatment program going where there is clear survival importance and benefit for that treatment.